Blazers hosting the Thunder, and the Thunder are 12-point road favorites. The over-under is at 224.5. The Thunder are minus 720 on the money line, and the Blazers are plus 520. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip-off tomorrow. They've played each other three times this season, and the Thunder have won all three games. The first one in Portland, 134-91. The next one in OKC, 139.77. And then the last one in OKC, 111.109. Now, neither one of these teams play tonight. So we should be getting decent lineups for this one. Now, the Blazers have been just about as bad as the Grizzlies and the 76ers with their lineup lately. Head-to-head, -head, the Thunder have won their last 10 games that they've played against the Blazers. The underdog is 7-3 against the spread, while the favorite is 5-5 five five on the money line. The home team's won the last two. The home team is 5-5. Five five. The under has hit in their last two. The under is 6-4. And, and the over-under at 224.5 is 5-5. Five five. All the games that they've played this season, with the exception of one, they've won by at least 12 points. They've won by 40, 43, then 60, and then they won by two. I mean... For the Thunder, they're 7-3 and three in that last 10, 7-3 and three against the spread, and the over is 6-3-1. and one. They're 2-2 two and two in that last four. The last three that they've played, they've been on the road. There was a total of 207, 250, 228, and then 220. Beating the Rockets by 17, losing by 14 to the Spurs, beating the Suns by 8, and then losing to the Lakers by 12, but that was in a back-to-back. -back. And the under is hitting their last two. For the Blazers... They're 2-8 in their last 10, 3-7 against the spread. The over is 6-4. They've covered their last three games. There was a total of 202, 214, 207, and then 233 points. Losing by 10 to the Heat, then losing, uh, beating the Grizzlies by 30, and beating the Grizzlies by 7, and then losing to the T-Wolves by 5. All of those games were on the road. I'm going to take the Thunder with the money line. I'm going to take the Thunder laying the points. And I'm going to go under because if the Thunder, I mean, if the Blazers aren't playing anyone, the question is, are they going to score 100 points? You know what? I'm going to lean over because looking at some of these scores, if they get close to 90, there's a chance it goes over to 24 and a half. So I'll go over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.